This video will demonstrate the execution of a trade using the FXCM web-based platform. Please note, this is a demo trade only. These numbers are not intended for use with an actual trade. When you receive a trade alert from Wealth Generators, it will be delivered in English, Spanish, and Japanese. There are four basic types of trade alert. A sell stop order, or a sell limit order. There is also a buy stop order or a buy limit order. Once you receive a trade alert from Wealth Generators, you'll need to open the FXCM web-based trading platform. Once there, there are three basic types of trades that you can enter. A sell or a buy which will enter the market at current market conditions, or an entry order. An entry order will enter the market at specific conditions that you dictate, like a buy stop, a sell stop, a buy limit, or a sell limit order. This order is a sell stop order, so we will be using the entry button. Now it's time to start entering the information from your trade alert. In the Order Entry dialog box, the first drop-down box is your account number. Make sure this number matches your current account number. The symbol is the pair that we will be trading on this particular order. In this case, it's the Euro US Dollar. The action is either a buy or a sell. In this case, our action is a sell order. The amount box is the amount of risk or the position that you're going to take on this order. For this demonstration trade, we will be taking a position of 10K, meaning our risk will be $1 per pip on this trade. The entry price is referred to as the rate. It is the rate that you will be entering for this order. From the trade alert, you'll see the entry price is 1.0936. There are two choices for time and force. You can either have a day trade, meaning the trade will expire at the end of this calendar day, or you can have a good tell canceled. In this case, we would want good tell canceled. That way, we can cancel this order whenever we choose to cancel it. The next line is the stop loss, or the stop. You check the box for stop, and then enter the rate from the stop part of the trade alert. In this case, it is 1.0997. The limit box is where you would put a target price, but in this case, we have no target price selected. We'll enter a target price at a later time. So we would leave the limit box blank. If we did have a limit price, we would click the box and then enter the rate that you would find on the order. Once you've completed all this, double check your work and then click the OK box and your trade will be executed. Now let's demonstrate the same trade using the mobile platform. For this demonstration, we will be using an iPhone. However, the platform on the Android phone is identical. First, you'll want to click the app for FXCM. Once there, navigate on the bottom of the screen to the Rates tab. Once you click that, you'll see all the rates come up on the screen. And then you'll want to find the rate that you're looking for. In this case, it's the Euro US Dollar. The type of order that we'll be doing is an entry order because we want to enter this order at the exact price that we choose, not at the current market price. So hit the entry button. The first box is the risk. Again, in this trade, we'll be taking a 10K risk, meaning $1 per pip. Next, we'll enter if this is a buy or a sell order. In our case, it's a sell order. Then we'll go to the rate box and we will enter the entry price or the rate that we want to enter the market at. In this case, our rate is 
The time in force, again, is good till canceled. We do not want a day trade that would cancel itself at the end of the day. There is no limit on this order. However, we do have a stop loss. Click the box for a stop loss, then enter the amount for the stop loss. In this case, it's 1.0997. Once you're done with that, double check your work and click the submit button. You'll receive an order confirmation and that's it. Your trade is complete.